This morning and a little bit after 9.30, uh, officers were dispatched to the 100 block of Mescalero Northwest in reference to a domestic violence incident that was occurring inside a residence. Officers had received information that an adult male who lived there, who was actually a son of the residence, was out of control uh, and throwing items inside the house. As officers arrived in the area, they received additional information that the male subject who had been causing the disturbance had left, left the area on a bicycle. A description was given of that subject and officers as they were responding noticed that a person matching that description at the corner of 4th and Mescalero, at which time officers stopped that person and began having dialogue with him. That person became very upset. He actually attacked one of the officers, attacked him holding a crucifix or a cross in one of his hands and actually began beating the officer about the head and actually hit him in the head with the crucifix. Officers then got into a physical confrontation with the male subject while fighting with him. Uh, we had several citizens also stop to assist the officers in dealing with the person who was described by witnesses as being basically in control of the fight with the officers. And during the fight, officers did deploy their taser and did tase that person uh, that they were fighting with uh, at least one time, if not more than one time. He was eventually taken into custody with assistance of the officers and civilians that had stopped to help. Rescue was called, not for the subject, because he was fine talking with the officers, but for the officer who had received a laceration to his head by being hit with the cross. While rescue was attending to the officer, the subject uh, began to have a medical type of condition, uh, went into a cardiac arrest. Since rescue was there, they began immediately providing first aid. He was transported to a local hospital and we received information that he has succumbed uh, and has passed away. Uh, exactly why he passed away, we do not know, but because he was in our custody, because he had just been in a confrontation with officers and just been tased, we are treating this as a full call-out investigation. So we've got members from the multi-jurisdictional response team here, APD, State Police, BCSO, the Office of Medical Examiner and the District Attorney's Office. So we'll do a complete investigation. Obviously, uh, we're all interested to see exactly what happened as far as the autopsy results go. The male subject uh, who was deceased was described as being very large and overweight. So we don't know if he had a heart attack or some other type of medical episode. But because there's just too many questions that we don't know the answers to yet, we're going to go ahead and treat it as a, uh, as a full investigation as an officer-involved incident.